All right, here we go, martial artists. Psy class is starting right now. So make sure that you have your psy down by your side. You can stand with your back straight and just wait for me to get in ready to go. Here we go, you guys. So working on your psy form today, take your psy, place them between your hands, down by your side, and if you come together, and bow. Excellent. So uh, we're going to pick up exactly where we left off last week off the psy form. And then we're going to add in another small section. So uh, what you're going to notice is that it, the kata just builds. Now, technically, technically, we finished your sci form, Intermediate Advanced Thoughts, last week. <gasps> that's right. You actually did the entire thing with me last week. So if you're still struggling on that portion, then that's okay. But there's so much more of this sci form to do to complete the form start to finish. And if you're at home. If you have nothing better to do, then you might as well do your psi work and keep improving with it. So that's our look for today. It's, I'm going to be adding to the form now. So all my adult TKD guys, this will be the section of kata you're going to want to keep learning and grow with. And all my intermediate advanced guys, I'll let you know where your form stops. And then you can just make that choice to keep going. As a matter of fact, um, just putting that challenge out to you, you know, there's no reason why you couldn't do the entire thing unless you didn't want to. But I think that you do. I know that you do. It's why you're here tuning in today with me, is to make sure that we're getting this stuff done. So let's just warm up first. Get together, sir. And bow. Again, separate those psi out. And let's just work through a couple flips for you guys real quick. I'm going to walk a little closer to you so we can all work together. Now, just flipping the psi out. Pick your best hand. Let's go 15 seconds on one hand. Take it out. Bring it back. We'll just go. I got a clock over here, so just watch it. And we'll just get that good and warmed up for you. Make sure all the pieces are right. Start getting the hang of that flip, right? That's the hard part. It's getting that thumb to set just right to make that flip happen. You got that, Jack? How about a little bit extra? You can take it. You can actually flip it. Ooh, not that side. Hmm. Keep that. You can flip it. Ooh, what am I doing? Oh, I know. <laughs> there we go. Go in and out. Swing in. Another hand now. In and out. Now, Zach, watch. That's what I wanted to do. That's the game. Okay, in and out. In and out. Just flip it and then in and out. Through. There it is. There it is. So in and out. Keep working it. A few more seconds. In and out. In and out. Let's go through our parts one more time. Make sure all of our parts are correct. So remember on the side parts, every part has its own function, its own job, its own role. So the tip of the side is known as the sucky. Then we have the long piece in the center, the baton, known as the nochi. Go. The center of the side, where it all comes together, is known as the moto. The yokum, the sume or the smith, the suka or the negi handle, and then the top of the sai is known as the sukugashiri, right? or I'll call it sagashi if I'm being quick. So, saki, inochi, moto, yokum, smith or sume, suka, sukugashiri or sagashi. So remember, we start your kata and start your form today that you're going to start with one side tucked into the belt line on the left side, and your side is going to also be in the left hand, so you're double loading the left side of the body okay, on the kata so far. There are a couple turns to get right. Uh, what may be helpful is to go ahead and, instead of trying to orient your, excuse me, instead of trying to orient yourself, orient the room. So take a pillow, put it over here to your left side. Take a, a something, take another you know, grab somebody else's stuff, put it over here on the side. Just get a left, a right, a front, and a back of the floor to help you kind of orient. So if I go left, you know, left means red pillow. You know, right means green noodle. You know, back means G.I. Joe, and the front means the TV itself. You know, whatever works best for you guys to help orient the space, so that'll work. That might be something that could be helpful for you. Um, I'm going to go ahead and start the kata now. We're going to pick up to everything we've done so far. That's more of a review. And then I'm going to teach the next section. If you're still struggling on a part to review from previous work, you can go back on our Facebook or on our YouTube channel and look at the side classes from last week, the week before, and the week before. We're only adding small bits of kata throughout that cycle. So if you're still struggling on last week's material, go back and revisit last week's class. Okay? Go back and revisit the week before that's class until we get it right. But this train keeps moving forward. I hope that you're moving forward with me. Keep practicing them. We'll be in good shape. So, big deep breath in and breathe out. And 
So we go together and bow. Step out, rest and ready. Right hand first, right? Rising flat block, first move. I'm going to turn left and down block left. Step up and drop down punch right. Yeah. Now remember our pattern. Fan smack, down punch, punch. Right hand's going to grab the side. Stand up where you are. Don't move your feet. Just pull your front foot back a little bit. Okay? From here, fan right, step out, smack, down block, punch, punch. Now your back foot, your back foot's going to pull. You're going to look at your own back foot and then move the back foot around to the right side of the room. Left hand, fan left, step out, smack, down block, punch, punch. Now I'm going to face toward the camera. You should be facing the back wall away from the front, okay? I'm just going to take my front foot and move it up again, okay? Sorry, my back foot and move it to make it my new front foot on my right side. Same pattern. Fan, smack, down, punch, punch. Here's that weird step from a couple weeks ago. Front foot steps all the way across and becomes my back foot. High cover, low press, high cover. Now you have your punch and quick strikes, right? Step up, punch right, quick strike right high, and then down block. Step up, punch left, quick strike left, and then down block left. Step up, punch right again. Now big stance in the punch, do the whole pattern. Pull that right foot back, fan, step out, smack, down block, punch, punch. Now we have last week's work. X block low, pull back for a double. Remember on the double, Things like keeping that gap in the hand proper, in that frugal stance, all those details. Step out from here, double punch down, pull back, step out again, double punch high, big open circle. It smacks in front, double smack down on top of the shoulders, okay? Double down block, punch left, right, X, and pull back to that double again. Now, intermediate advanced belts, guess what? That's all she wrote. That's the whole form for my juniors, okay? So if you're like, whoa, Mr. Hamill, I am still overwhelmed by that. Great. Go back and watch this again. Last week's video takes you through all of it again step by step. I'm going to add the next step. up. So for my adult Taekwondo guys, there is a new step off. So I'm back to my double here, okay? So went through that pattern. Here's the next part for you all to keep up and work with. My front foot, that same frugal front foot, my right leg over here, Okay, does the same step off we did a moment ago. Step off with the right foot, left leg forward. I guess what we're going to do now. Same pattern. So you should be facing the back wall away from me. Left foot's forward, high cover, low press, high cover. At this time, we're going to use our side to block against a downward stabbing bow. So there's something coming in and trying to stab me in the ankle with the leg. I'm going to pick up my right leg, keep my high cover, okay, open the side, Minochi out. I'm going to lift my knee chamber and knock the bow staff away. Down. See what I did there? So as I come in for the smack, I'm going to step up, bring the side out, smack down, cover the ankle, keep the high cover. As I step out, down block back in, down block, punch, punch. So one more time. Cover, press, cover. Pick up your right leg, your back leg. Smack down, open, close it back in, down block. A lot of transition there. Okay? Punch left, right. Same thing on my left side. So on the right side of the room, because I'm looking at the back wall right now, right? Okay? Pick up my left foot, cover right. Left hand's going to smack down, back in, down block, punch back, front. So right, left. Okay? Let's go over that a few more times. Make sure we have that pattern right, Okay? So back to my double, facing toward the face toward the TV. Front foot steps off again because my back foot. Now I'm facing the back wall. High, low, high. Break away right, right, down, punch, punch. Ooh. Break away left, high cover, high cover first. There's your knock away. Down block, punch, punch. Sweet. Okay, two more times. So from that focal double. Step off again. High, low, high. Back foot pulls up. One, two, three. Cover. Smack again. 
two, three. Two more times. On my double. Step up. High, low, high. Smack, down, punches, cover smack, down, punches. That's why it's so important that the, the, you have the ability to flip them so quick and transition are fast because, again, just watch this transition. Watch it at speed. Boom, there's my cover, okay? Bow, bow. Before my foot hits the ground, I've taken it out and brought it back in one transition. So I'm here, press here, back foot picks up, smack, down, punch, punch, turn around, smack, down, punch, punch. Okay? Okay, at this time, I'm gonna change up the angles on you a little bit, just to give you a chance to work through it, see a couple of different looks. Um, so I'm going to reorient myself in the kata. Feel free to work the same as you are, or just reorient with me. So I'm going to change where the front of my room is, okay? So I'm going to stand over here on this side. Here's my front, okay? My left, my right, and my back, okay? Excellent. Hey, Isaiah. Hey, Stephen. Hey, Nathan. Mr. Bruner just got the board up to me so I can see everybody. Hey, Donnie G. Hey, Jake. Hey, Tyler. Hey, Evie. Harrison's here. Emma's here. Thanks for tuning in. You guys are doing great. So... Ready? And rest. Ready. Let's go through it. Give you a big deep breath in. And exhale. In. One. Turn. Down. Step up. Drop down. Yeah. Now we'll go through the whole pattern. Grab the side. Stand up. Fan. Smack. Down. Punch. Punch. Pull the back foot around. Fan left. Smack. Down. Punch. Punch. Back foot pulls up. Fan. Smack. Down, punch, punch. Step off for your high cover. High, low, high. Step up. Right, quick attack, down. Left, quick attack, down. Right, full pattern. Smack, down, punch, punch. X and tight. Double, double. Open, down. Double, punch, punch. X and tight. New part. Step up again. High, low, high. Here's your breakaway. Breakaway, down, punch, punch, cover. Breakaway, down, punch, punch. Yeah. How's that? Yikes. Okay. All right. I need a brain for a minute. That's a lot. Okay. Let's go through that again. So side ready, tucked in tight. Let's get some water and choke it. Okay. Hey, Donovan. Oh, okay. So, again, I'm going to go through it one more time, changing my angle, and just reorient to the room again. So now, this is my front. The camera side is my left. Back wall is my left. The TV is my right. Okay? And then behind me is this wall. So, I'm going to do it one more time to the pattern. Just stay with me as you go through it, best you can. Okay? The next time we'll go through it facing the right direction with you again. All right, so let's work together again through it. Just trying to give you different looks and angles to get you to kind of see maybe some of the small nuances that might be there with it. So rest, ready, and rising, turn, down block. Step up, guard down, punch. Ayah! Grab the sock, stand up, right side forward, fan, smack, down block, punch, punch. Pull around to your backside, fan left, smack, down block. Punch, punch, pull your back foot up, fan, smack, down block, punch, punch. Step off, high, low, high. Step up, punch, quick attack, down, punch, quick attack, down, punch, and full pattern. Fan, smack, down, punch, punch. Cross and set, double punch down, low, high, open. Down, double down, punch, punch, cross, and set. Now, again, intermediate advance belts. That's where it stops for you guys. If you're like, Mr. Hamlet, it's so much. That's okay. It stops there. Step up with the right foot now. Add some more. High, low, 
high. Right foot picks up, break away, down, punch, punch. Left side picks up, break away, down, punch, punch. That's all I added today. Okay? Whew. Let's do it one more time. Ready? Okay. Okay, so looks like I had some static in the headset. Should have turned it off mic on. That might be a better look. Uh, if it is, let us know. Mr. Bruner's monitoring for me, so I get a chance to see if I've got enough static figured out. So uh, let's go through it one more time. Hopefully you can hear me clearly now without static, and uh, we'll go from there, guys. So here we go. Ready? In the left hand, in the right hand, and feet come together, and down, and rest. Ready. Do the whole thing again, facing this way. Break down each move, adding in the new section. It's our last time through it today, guys. So here we go. Right side. Turn and down block. Step up, drop down, punch. Grab the side. Stand. And one, two, down block, punch, punch. Back foot pulls around, fan left. Smack. Down block, punch, punch. Pull your back foot up, facing the back wall. Fan, smack, down block, punch, punch. Front foot steps off, high, low, high. Step up, punch, quick, down. Step up, punch, quick, down. Step up, punch, fan, smack, down, punch, punch. Cross low. Pull for that double block. Step out, double punch down. Pull back. Right foot stays forward. Step out, double punch high. Keep your right foot in front. Open, smack, down. That double attack on the shoulders. Pull them back in. Double down. Punch, punch. X and double. Intermediate advance. You stop here or keep going with me. Front foot again. Steps off to the left. High. Low, high. Here's my breakaway. Breakaway, down block, punch, punch. Right hand, left side, breakaway, down block, punch. Yeah. Okay. Feet come together and bow. Wow. What a journey we've been on with this so far, guys. Um, believe it or not, that's only about halfway maybe just a little over halfway uh, through the entire kata. So my adult Taekwondo guys, uh, get excited. This is the longest kata that we have in our entire system. Uh, and I, I really enjoy it. I know that you're going to enjoy it too. Keep working at it. Mr. Hamill, I'm still struggling on the stuff from last week. Go back and watch last week's class. Check out our YouTube channel on the link I put at the bottom of this video that's got your... Uh, link right to your Psy form. You can just replay over and over and over again. Mr. Kai is a little quick, but man, is he good. Um, have fun with it, guys, and just, it's okay. It's okay to struggle, you know. Um, you know, my guys in my normal, in my regular class, you know, my Harrisons and my Zayas and my Nathan, you know, guys, I struggle with you too. We struggle together, right? And we're on this journey together also. So don't expect to nail it, Nathan, on this first go. And don't get frustrated. Cut your mom and dad some slack, guys. Okay, They're trying to be the best teachers for you. I'm trying to be the best teacher for you. And I know you're trying your best to be the best student, too. So just breathe. We have time. That's the best part about this journey, guys. You've got a lot of free time right now. So we use our free time, and we just fill it up doing karate. What else are you going to do? Play your iPad? If you are, check out our new Dragon Force Ninjas app. Uh, you can go on to any of the app stores and download Dragon Force Ninjas. Create your own profile, and you can sign up under us, Martial Arts America Team Pace. Uh, it'll come right up, and you can play Dragon Force Ninjas with Mr. Bruner and Mr. Hamill. We can give you all kind of cool things like tokens to buy new outfits and cool ninja sword weapons and stars and 
all kinds of stuff. But uh, I logged in today for the first time to look at it. It's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. I need a controller. I can't do the, the tablet controller. It messes my brain up. And so I'm just going to make my PlayStation controller work for it instead. It's going to be a good time. Uh, guys, give yourself some slack. Breathe through it. Tune in on Thursday for the same look and the same material. And if you need extra work, check out our YouTube channel. All of our Facebook Live videos are on YouTube also underneath Martial Arts America Pace Live Classes. So you can go back and look at any of these classes from previous work and go through it. Mr. Stewart and Mr. Kiley also are loading the same classes up. So if you'd like a different teacher just to get a different perspective, sometimes that helps. Uh, Mr. Kiley and Mr. Stewart are both also great too. So check us out. Check everything out. Go online. Watch it all. Do the Dragon Force Ninja thing and practice. And guys, breathe. You're going to do great. You're going to be great. Thank you all for tuning in for side class, junior advanced belt. You start in just a few minutes, guys. So take a breath, get some water, and get ready to work for the next part of Samurai Set. We come together and bow. You guys are dismissed. Have a great afternoon and work hard. We'll see you soon.